So ladies and gentlemen, what's up? I'll go by the name East Coast Prince and if you are new to my channel, welcome. Well, um, we're on the MI series, we're on that long line of reacting to all the songs in MI's EP. I've, re I've reacted to one which is The Commandments and now I'm reacting to another one and today we are reacting to Trinity. If you notice, MI songs, the songs in the EP, all of them are linked together. The Trinity, the Lion, the Sacrifice, the Warrior, the Commandments, like it's all biblical character. Judah, the name of the, the EP, Jude, um, Judah, the EP, everything has to do with biblical characters. So you know that this interlinks, there's a storyline in the linkage. MI makes sure that it puts a lot of creative storylines and poetic stuff in his, in his music. So there's a lot of links in it and if you notice there's always a coin toss at the beginning of almost every song so with that being said let us react to trinity and without further ado let's go the best of the best east coast springs i know it's better than the rest east coast springs the rap in no one contest east coast springs Father, Son, and Holy Ghost Give me blessing till I overdose I got a lot of haters, a lot of foes But I'm the nigga that they owe the most Yeah, yeah Father, Son, and Holy Ghost I know they wanna see a nigga comatose I got a lot of haters, a lot of foes but I'm the nigga that they owe the most yeah, I had a friend yeah. from Senegal Who told me you gon' send them all Packing so sit back and light a Dutch Produce and end them all They gon' try to pretend at all your events Because they can sense that you're invincible Highly focused and integral to the game But none of your principles are the same They all are victims of shame As they sit and witness your reign The differences between you and these simpletons is insane They can't inseminate hearts Only leave an impotent stain Yeah, you see our father the game Go check the record books When rappers couldn't get DJs to play them like the second hooks Nowadays, vultures are certain Circling and certain men are working in tandem to plan the downfall of the culture. I am he, the silent force of end. Your father, your daddy, the wisdom, the savvy, the blueprint, you try it all to win. If you've lost road, I'm the source code, I am boss mode. So come sit at my feet, I'm a teacher and I'm the last poet. I am father, father, son, and holy ghost. Wow, it might say the Lord in this song, man. I'm, first of all, I talked about his friend from Senegal who was telling him about the game, telling him about uh, how, he's, how he's respected in the game. And if he has to really stay in his lane, like be a boss that he is in the game, you know how people respect him, so he should keep doing what he does. Then he now went, he said something about um, um, the source code, he embossed the most and something like that, like that. I like the scheme, so I want to take it back to that code and just admire that rhyme scheme again. Culture, I am he, the silent force of end. Your father, your daddy, the wisdom, the savvy, the blueprint, you try it all to win. If you've lost road, I'm the source code, I am boss mode. So come okay, you see, if you lost road, I'm the source code, I'm in boss mode. Put out my feet, I'm a teacher, and I'm the last poet. Okay, so if I put out my feet, I'm the teacher, and I'm the last poet. I am father, father, son, and holy God. I am father. So basically, what he's saying is that he's the godfather of the game, and he's like the, he's the big boss of the game, basically. So. The Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. So you can understand where the name of the title of the, mo uh, of the song came from. Um, Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. They are the Trinity, the heavenly body, the Trinity. So let's go. Give me blessing till I overdose. I got a lot of haters, a lot of foes. But I'm the nigga that they owe the most. Yeah, yeah. Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. I know they want to see a nigga comatose. I got a lot of haters, a lot of foes. But I'm the nigga that they owe the most, yeah, yeah. Feel the Holy Ghost is where you're sure that this anointing will only follow those who get the message and can express it until the homie knows. Learn the lesson in one direction, they fall like dumb and nose. Okay, 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 okay. Well, I like AQ, man. I like AQ. The fact that he, his, his um, rap style is very different, he just basically drove the flow and he goes. He said that, final, that, that um, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost, this message is for all, all those people who want to, who don't, doesn't know the most. And um, he said that um, they get the message, they learn the lesson, and they fall in one direction like the dominoes. I like that line, I like that line. You know, dominoes always fall in one side, so fall in one direction like the dominoes. So I like how he just went and he dropped this flow, he started. AQ is a boss, man. AQ is a boss in this game. Those who don't know AQ, please. You can go and check his other songs, his old songs, even before he was signed to Chuck City. AQ has been doing this. He has been doing this thing for a long time, for a very long time. So let's continue. 
when the spirit moves, I'm in rooms with fire figures. You Pharisees, your fantasies are sacrilegious. I'm the hand that raised a man with hard corrections. Stacking sacks and sacks like Sunday service tight collections. I'm giving vi Stacking hands on sacks like Sunday service tight collections. Stacking hands on sacks like Sunday service tight collections. You know, when they are gathering tight now, they put their hands in the sack. So when he also says standing hands on sack, I think he's talking about how he's trying to get his own money, grab his own money. Now what I think is that line, though. let's continue. Visions, the revelation of a thousand hours to perfection, the intersection of the crown is ours. I've been around since time created dinosaurs, sudden crowds that got aroused by Diana Ross in a space that only relates to Santa Claus. I'm like a myth, but giving gifts is my kind of job. I rip. Okay, it's like in a space that only relates to Santa Claus. I'm like a myth, but giving gifts is my kind of job. You know, Santa Claus gives gifts. And Santa Claus is also like a myth. It's like it's not real. It's like a fantasy. Everybody talks about it, but it's not actually happening. It's not in real life. There's no reality to Santa Claus. So, but this is giving, giving gifts is, is kind of job. So the gift that he is basically blessing us with is his bars. So that I assume is, is from the song. Let's continue. Sins and strip clean the victims, desolation of nations. Uh, I am the east wind, casualties is human life. Fuck your human rights when I move the body count is grounded sugar like you fear me, but hear me. I am the comforter, I am peace, I am war, I am cold, the hot water. Wow, I am peace, I am war, I am cold, I'm the hot water. He said um, I demolish nations. I'm like the east wind. You know the east wind is like a hurricane. It basically goes and destroys nations, man. Eh? Then he said uh, we said something about him. Um, I am, you see, my body, your body count is sugar like. See, I don't know what he says, something about um, your body count is sugar like. Yeah? I, don't, I, didn't, I didn't get that line properly, but I'm not going back. So let's continue. My pen is lost, my flow is like the day of Pentecost. To understand it, I make you speak a different language. With the signs, with between the lines, unless it's fair weather. The oh man, this guy is so many flows. Like, I have to just respect AQ. Every line in this song is about from AQ. Every song in this line is about. So I'm taking it back to get this part. This um, read the lines, and then it said something about um, it said it's, it's flows are like the day of um, uh, uh, like the day of Pentecost because it got you speaking different languages or something like that. So I'm taking it back a little bit and to get the line. It's lost, my flow is like the day of Pentecost To understand it, I make you speak a different language With the signs, with between the lines, unless it's fair weather Then I'm raining punches, I'm undefeated, who can say it better? The Man, God, God, man, this should be the hardest line I've heard this year from anybody. This should be the hardest line I've heard this year from anybody, to be honest. So, look at what AQ said. AQ said, um, he said, um, he said, uh, how do you even say it? He said, he said, his lines make you, uh, like the day of Pentecost, it makes you read, uh, speak a different language. Then he said that, he, um, you have to reach in between the lines. It's like Mayweather. It got you speaking punches. Yeah, I said. I'm taking it back so that I could really dissect that line because I understand the line. To explain it, I understand it, but I need to literally say the way it is so that I can explain it better. My pen is lost, my flow is like the day of Pentecost To understand it, I make you speak a different language With the signs, with between the lines, unless it's fair weather Then I'm raining punches, I'm undefeated, who can say it better? Okay, I said, read the lines, read between the lines um, Unless it's me weather, I'm raining punches I'm raining punches um, on, I'm undefeated, who can say it better? I think that's what he said So basically, he said, reading between the lines Unless it's Mayweather. So he's talking about the lines, he's talking about the lines of his verses. That's that like when he talked about Pentecost and his verses. He talked about the, the, his rap style. Basically, his rap style makes you speak a different language. So he's talking about the lines. Say so when he said, read it between the lines. Then he said, unless I'm raining, I'm raining, um, how do you even put it? Unless I'm raining punches, I'm undefeated, you can say it better. So when you talk about rain, uh, raining punches, raining punches has to do with the raining punches like, the punches Mayweather, the boxer gives, then also talking about Mayweather, um, then raining, raining, like rain that is falling, raining, Mayweather is always usually raining, so rain, rain that is falling on you. Then 
Then you say I'm undefeated, you can see it better. Man, that was like a triple atandra. Talking about the weather, rain falling, talking about the weather, me weather, the boxer, then talking about the punches, talking about the lines, his flow. Come on, AQ is just on, is a god on his own, man. Let's continue. These rappers are false prophets, I am not with them They prophesy lies and visions, spread it with confidence They don't paint no pictures, they photoshopping and cropping them hey, they See, they don't paint no pictures, they photoshopping and cropping them Wow You know, when someone doesn't paint the picture, it doesn't make you see the, clear, the clarity of the thing, of things They are just telling the lies, they are just giving the blood picture of the true story They are giving you the fake version to listen to, watch or to hear So you don't really get the true picture of what they are saying the reckoning is when we come for them. The competent artists, labels, and managers, I covered them all. They down my sacrifice, they walk away, they stumble and fall. Wow, am I? Am I? See all these managers, I cover them all. They down my sacrifice, they walk away, they stumble and fall. Man, and that's the truth. They must sacrifice a lot of people in this game, and it's covered a lot of people's houses in the game. So there are a lot of things that Emma is doing in the back end that really nobody knows that Emma is really doing this. But Emma is doing a lot in the back end that we need to appreciate him for. Because the truth is that MI man, MI is really a lot of it. There's a lot going on in the in the Nigerian music scene that we don't know about. But MI really does a lot in the Nigerian music scene that we don't know about. Even trying to support other labels, trying to bring out new artists, trying to make peace among people. So he knows what he's saying when he's saying it there. MI has just been so far been one of the guys that is really like very consistent in the game, very consistent, like he's putting in work effortlessly. Every time he puts in work in the game, so he has a lot he's doing, man. Both as a rapper, both as a manager, and both as an advisor to other artists out there. Emma is like a role model to a lot of artists. So let us continue. Oh, that my word is scripture. You blessed if I am standing with you, but question the vessel. You mess it with science, spiritual will oh. I died a couple times so you can flourish. Gave you love and I encouraged, but damn it, your heart is porous. Okay, you say that a lot of times so you can flourish. What he's basically saying there is that. He has put in a lot of sacrifice and he has tried to like hold his um, when I say hold his fame and hold his projects back so that other people could flourish. So let's continue. Now that you've left me, how are you faring? Are you soaring somewhere foreign, touring, rising like the sun is every morning? I am the sun that you condemn to die every time that you tell him lies, but my life is indemnified to next. Wow, I am the sun that you condemn to die, and any time you tell him lies, but well, my life is indemnified. Ah. Emma is lyrics. Emma is like the, one of the most brilliant lyricists I know. I've said before, Emma is the best lyricist in Africa. Nobody can tell me nothing. Forget about bars and punchlines. There's depth to Emma's words, and there's always a deeper meaning to what Emma says. So, um, before that, he said that um, now that you've left me, are you flourishing? I'm sure he's talking about all the artists that he signed that at some point he had an issue with them and they left him to do other stuff. And most of them that left Emma. After they left MI's record label, after they left basically Chocolate Cities, Chocolate Cities is not MI's record label, he's just the chairman there. Where he's, he has put in work, so he has stake there, but I will not call it his record label because other people too have stake in Chocolate City too. So, but MI is basically talking to a lot of stars left um, Chalk City to do their own thing, and I don't think anybody that left Chalk City has shined on their own since they left Chalk City. But I'm not, I don't, I don't even talk about Ice Prince and Jesse Jazz that were eligible to leave. I'm talking about the new guys that. People like Millie, uh, people like um, Coca and all those people, they left Chocolate City and they're not really shining on their own. So I'm sure Emma is referring to these guys too. Let's continue. Time that you mention, I am shooting at you. Hope the bitch that you was tempted by is semper fi. Blood splatter, the brain matter is bone shattered. The thumb backwards, your thumb scatters, it's crumb chatter. Wow, man. This seed the rhyme scheme. The rhyme scheme reminds me of something that Eminem will say. He said the blood splatter, the brain matter, the leave something shatter, shatter. I'm taking it back so I can just enjoy that scheme again. The blood splatter, the brain matter is bone shattered. Your thumb backwards, your thumb scatters, it's chrome chatter. The sun is turning to sun burning, I've gone savage. The sun is turning to sun burning, I've gone savage. Wow. Let me take you back. Ain't matter is bones shattered. Your thumb backwards, your thumb scatters, it's crumb chatters. The sun is turning to sun, burning, I've gone savage. I'm hands off for you, nigga. Carry your own baggage. If I want I'm hands off for you, nigga. I've hands up. So I, I'm not gonna help you carry your problems anymore. People should carry your own baggage, carry your stuff, carry your mistakes and go. Suffer the consequences of your own. I'm not helping anymore. 
Teach you to shine, you will be gone, banished, finished, famished. Show me how sinister man is. You're on your own now, but no motion, can't figure mechanics. What you gonna tell him this time? Who you gonna blame for the damage? You're on your own now, um, your own motion, can't figure mechanics. Wow, that's a good line. What he's saying there basically, he's saying um, you're on your own now, your own motion. So you should move on your own, move in the game on your own, move in the music industry on your own. Can't figure mechanics. Basically, the mechanics in the game is talking motion. You know, motion has to do with cars, automobiles, and mechanics to fix things. So basically, he's putting himself as an, a mechanic here. Okay, can't figure mechanics. That means you don't, you are not going to have any help out game in the music industry as you move on your own. I'm not going to help you anymore. I can't fix your shit anymore. I'm just going to be on my own. So basically, am I in this song? Am I being the daddy? You know, say father, son, and holy ghost. So he's basically talking about him being the daddy and um, the son. The son, like the people that the artist he has raised in the game, then the Holy Ghost. I don't know the Holy, the Holy Ghost character and, and what he's saying though. But I basically know that him is talking about himself as the daddy in the game and trying to help sons. And some of them have left him and gone, some have been loyal and stayed and stuff like that. So um, let's continue. The son of man, or you gonna tell him the truth? I ain't do you no evil, nigga. Only evil was you. Okay, this song is definitely referring to somebody. I don't know who was, who is the person that. The song is directed to, but I know definitely someone that left MI, and I'm suspecting Millie a lot. I don't know why I'm suspecting Millie because Millie, other people have publicly like reconciled with M, but Millie, even though Millie did as if him and M were on good terms, there was a time that they were dissing M online. I don't know if it was the, uh, I don't know if it was the whole FU challenge that they did that, um, that um, this girl. This girl from Chocolate City that time, we got her name. This I don't know if she's from Kenya. The girl from Chocolate City that she was formerly Chocolate City. She now came and dissed them. So that is Millie or her that is referring to in this song. I, I don't know. I forgot her name, please. If you can remember the lady that was in Chocolate City, aside Price, the other lady that was in Chocolate City, that later came out to say nonsense about Chocolate City. Man, let's continue. The son of man has come to tell you the truth. I ain't do you no evil, nigga. All the evils in you. Uh, Father, son, and Holy Ghost. Give me blessing till I overdose. It's like you knew niggas would do the most. <laughs> it's why you gifted me your pen to coast. Uh. Okay, okay, okay. I like the last line. The last line in this song is like a very strong ending. It say, it say like you knew niggas would do the most. That's why you give you have gifted me the pen to coast. All right, that was like a double attendra before because say like you know the guys who do the most like okay you like God, you know that hey, um, these people will try to do the most and hate me and try to put me so he gifted me a pen to coast. Pen to coast means literally a pen for him to write, that is, to write his lines that will go far to go, go to coast to coast. Then also pen to coast. Pentecost is when people were speaking in different languages. When people were, they got the Holy Spirit and they're speaking the different languages. So, um, also Pentecost, like, okay, that he, gave, he gifted me with um, the ability to speak in different languages, to appeal to people of different sects. So that's a very strong ending from Emma. You know, Emma is a poem, is a poet, sorry. He's a poet, he went to Michigan University and studied poetry in the University, or in the university of Michigan in the US. So you can see why the, his lyrics, there's always that poetic, creative writing in his lyrics. So basically, um, that's the end of this. So basically, the Holy Spirit in this song is um, God gifts, it, is God's gifts to him. Sent him the ability to write, his ability, his gifts that God gave him to write consciously and write um, very good lyrics. That's the Holy Spirit in the song. While him himself is putting himself as the father, uh, as the father, father of other artists as a godfather in the game of other artists and also talking about his source his source are basically the artists that he had brought into the game and also the ones that have been prodigal that have left him in the game so the whole the whole the trinity is a very creative very creative song so far and it's a very nice jam please i know i talk a lot and but i have to dissect it to the best of my ability and um guys if you are new to my channel please don't forget to hit that like button please Hit that subscribe button and I'll see my next reaction. Peace.